All right, so my first test ban actually gave me a couple little tiny pieces. Oh, right there. Oh, hello, friend. And right there. Um, there's a lot of black sand in this, which is it's awesome. I'm not sure if I'm going to be using my shovel, though, like the whole time, because... And it's just like in, in little spots, you know, it's, it's just too big to work. But this, I mean, just this area looks really awesome to, uh, to dive. So, oh, kind of sucks, like, having to waste time to go back in town. But um, before I came up, I stopped at the gas station and uh, had a little chat with the person there that was helping me out and she said that there's like a, a mining association type place in town where I can get a stake on a claim maybe around here for like and like other areas too obviously for like 30 bucks a year membership whatever so I might stop in there and um, I don't know get a membership and then and then head back and then actually find a place to, to set up camp and then get and then get to it so that's cool though that my first test scan yielded a little gold pretty happy about that oh man so i think i got in at like 7 a.m or something like that it's noon all right couldn't have been in that long. Been in a long time. Haven't found anything. So I'm glad I brought my pan and some of my tools because I can still I can still get in and uh, do some other work. And hopefully I'll get lucky on uh, on that end of things. Sun's finally starting to come out. It's feeling good. I am like need to warm up a second yeah, I need, need to go back into town too Shoot. Well, anyways I'll uh, update again if I get anything now you tell me is that gold because when I hold it to a certain light man it has a shine to it but it has all this stuff on it and it looks like it looks like quartz, right? But that looks, I think I might have first found my first, my first nugget. That is just absolutely crazy. And it's like right, right off like a main campsite where there's like, there's no signs or anything talking about fucking claims. And uh, let's see if that other piece it was accompanied by like a few other, uh, well, I'd have to like, have to retap it and pan it to, to, to show you, but it was accompanied with uh, some few other pieces of gold in there, micro pieces. But wow, man, like that, focus in on that motherfucker. Yeah. Oh man, focus, focus. Look at that. That is, man, that is fucking awesome. That, that is like, oh, you hear that? You gotta, you gotta drop it so you can hear the sound, right? Oh, <laughs> oh, one more time, one more time. Oh. Okay, I just wanted to show you where that beauty was hiding right there and I had to like use a crevicing tool uh, flathead uh, screwdriver and this perfect and spoon right but I had to dig way in there and uh, I, I, I pulled it out of there just wanted to give you a quick look at everything that I got yesterday um, and today that's that nugget, man. Oh, man. I still can't believe I got that. That was nuts.
I didn't classify either. No, uh, it just straight into the pan. Ooh, I love that sound. And all these, all these other like micro pieces I got uh, today. But they say gold is, see it's floating. So there's like a, there's a bunch in here though. Some decent um, smaller flakes. And then just a ton, a ton of micro. But I got some good stuff this time, man. I'm super, I'm super happy about that. Hopefully tomorrow um, will be even better with the spot I'm working at now. Okay, I'm back at uh, the spot I was working yesterday and I think I'm gonna spend like the whole day here. This uh, crevice right here is where I was getting like 20, 30 hits per pan. So that's not too bad. This whole area has to be like littered with, with gold. And I have a feeling like there might be something bigger here. And I was checking out that area, that crevice right there. It might be a little tricky working it because it's super slippery. And I only have my uh, waders on. I didn't, I'm not wearing my wetsuit or anything. So if I fall, I'm, <laughs> I'm screwed. But there's some, some crevicing right there too that I can get at. Some crevicing right right there that's kind of hidden um right there just this this whole area so just wanted to do a quick update i'm uh still working that spot every pan is taking me like like 15 minutes just because of the amount of black sand but every pan is giving me like 15 20 colors and like i'm getting uh every pan i'm getting like two three four um, around there um, pieces flakes around that size so that's that is just freaking like amazing I'm really hoping there's something bigger in this um, man it's just taking me forever to work because the amount of black sand there is oh my god but with every pan getting like 30 40 pieces like that that to me is just just absolutely amazing i'm like more than thrilled about it so i will continue to work this um one thing i didn't know is there's like a trail on the other side of this i thought this was uh pretty secluded um but i guess not so much um still i mean it's pretty private and I don't know, man. I'm thinking about going back into town for supplies because I'm, I'm leaving tomorrow, but uh, just blah, blah, blah. I'm rambling now. I'm going to get back to this, though. Pretty cool stuff. So I decided to come back to the spot I was working at yesterday. Um, just try, trying to work this uh, crevice. And it looks like there's crevices within crevices so that's really good um yesterday like i was saying every pan i was getting like a lot a lot of micro gold and um some decent sized smaller flicks so i'm gonna fill up the buckets worth um God, i wish i had would have brought more buckets because i would bring all this material home with me if i could but so far i wanted to show you everything i got I didn't like tap it all like all the way to the top or whatever oh that's a little nice uh piece right next to the nugget that i got and there's just like hundreds that there, there's just so much like uh micro stuff but man when you're when you're getting it like this man it does add up so it just kind of I wish there was a decent spot that I could have ran the sluice. Um, in the sluice that I had at home, I got off Amazon. I ended up sending it back because I just like, 
I don't know. I like the process of panning, honestly. Um, but when you're getting this much black sand and this much fine micro gold, um, setting up a sluice is kind of worth it. But like I said, I, I kind of like the process, you know, so, and if it takes a while and you're getting, you know, you're getting gold in every pan, I mean, that's pretty sweet to me. But man, I wish I would have found this place the first day I, you know, the first day I uh, came, man. It would have gave me a lot more time to like really work this entire area. So I'm going to fill up a bucket's worth and then um, I'm going to get out of here before too long. And then when I get home, work the material that I got in the bucket and then probably do a another video showing you what I got and maybe uh, putting on the scale and see how much that uh, how much I got total all right so I'm home now um, and I'm gonna start working this material but that I'll probably do another video because this, this is I have to classify it and it's just gonna take forever um, but th this is, uh, what I'm looking at right now as far as what I got up there plus that, a nice nugget. Um, I tried to work out most of black sand, um, the best I could, but, yeah, definitely not too bad. Um, I'm definitely hoping for as much, if not more, um, micro in there, which I'm, I'm fairly positive that there will be if not more so um yeah i guess i will update again once it is done